What's up guys, another test drive from Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. Today, 1966 Ford Mustang. Beautiful ride, 289. Let's open the hood. On this ride here, you got power steering, power brakes, smooth running motor. And of course, we're gonna take it down the road. Any flaws I see, you'll know about it. Detailed pictures, financing and shipping, maplemotors.com. And every Monday we put on new rides. I love these old Mustangs. Hey, if you don't mind, hit subscribe for now. Sit back, relax. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. Checking out the interior. Place those bets. You think the horn works on this one. Carpet's pretty clean. Dash looks good. I see a few little chips here on the bottom. I guess the dash used to be black and they painted it. Showing 21,000 miles. It's hard to stand behind original mileage in a 66 model. Loving the interior. Top works great on this one. I'm gonna leave it down because I'm taking it right back, putting it in the showroom. Starts up good. Let's try the turn signals. Popping up on the dash there, blinking. Both sides. Wipers. Working. Horn, did you place your bets on that? Power steering feels pretty good. Radio. It's on a deep. Working blower motor. It's blowing, no AC. But horn? Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Man, it was hooked up under the hood, too. I thought maybe it would work. I guess I could just throw the top up real quick. Seems like y'all yell at me whenever y'all don't put it up. Trust me, this one's nice. Check it out. Coming down fast. Interior part of it is nice. Your back window is like brand new. Let's go out on the outside. Since you got me to do it. <laughs> yeah, somebody's already replaced this one. It's very clean. A little wrinkly because when you have them down for a long period of time, they'll get that way. You get them in the sun out here and it'll straighten up. Let's drop it back down. We're gonna take off anything I see, you'll know about it. Oh, it's going down, down, baby. That's a great day to have a convertible, I can tell you that. I'll take it. Let's roll. Okay, seatbelts on. Let's roll. Anything I see, you'll know about it. smooth going down the road steering does have some slack you see that getting into the brakes here they're stopping just fine Feels like it's kind of dragging out as it's shifting into third there. Speedometer's coming up on the dash. Looks like our oil pressure gauge is working. Gas gauge is broken on this one. Temperature gauge is broken on this one as well.
pretty easy to drive here. A little bit of a right pull on the front end. When I let go of the steering wheel, we fade a little bit to the right there. I know a lot of cars are set up that way. This one's just pulling to the right like that. in the brakes a little bit of a left pull when you first hit the brakes go straight otherwise Okay guys, well I'm getting ready to pull up over here to the gas station. We're gonna leave there and head back to the lot. But before that, I'm gonna get some undercarriage shots, some interior shots, and we'll try to have a little bit of fun with this video. I'll be right back. All right, guys, getting ready to head on back to the lot here and back up a little bit. Let's roll.
pretty smooth going down the road. This road back here's got quite a few divots and bumps and it's handling them just right. Nice and smooth. When you first hit the brakes, you can kind of feel stress on the steering wheel as it's trying to pull to the left of hair and that goes away. seems pretty correct we're running about 35 in this one See how when you first hit it, it does it. I'm still in the brakes, it's not pulling to the left anymore, but when you first hit it, it will. Do got to manually turn off your turn signals there. Oh, they got the police out. What's the police doing? Pretty quiet in here. I hear the center of the steering wheel vibrating. the corner from the car a lot if you don't mind hit subscribe and share this video this helps me out quite a bit guys i'm also going to be doing picking out the flaws as soon as we get back to the lot so stick around for that that's where i'm going to walk around front to back of this car look at all the chips scratches dents anything i can find so you know the rest about it we also offer 100 detailed pictures financing and shipping at maplemotors.com here we go we're heading back i'll see you in a minute Okay, picking out the flaws. We're gonna walk around this ride. Let's go ahead and do it. Anything I see, you'll know about it. It's coming up around the front end here. It's got a nice chrome buffer on it. The lower end here is not all chipped up. Checking out the grill. Fairly clean. You do get a little bit of pitting popping up here from just age. 
you got some chips around this edge you got some chips there coming on down lower portion here up and over a little bit of stuff popping up here and there but everything seems pretty clean spot in the corner here double checking my stuff a little bit of pitting on your chrome not too bad up and over the fender a little chip there a couple chips at the bottom back that midsection a little touch up mark there door handles in good shape just checking it did pick up some dust on the test drive there so a little scratch there like sky a little scratch here in the corner front windshield on this one looks good trim looks good around that windshield we got a little bit of a gap right here. Chip there. Vent window's good, seal's good. Chrome looks good around the back. The top is in great condition. Check out detailed pictures of this top. It goes up and down just fine. The seal is in good shape. Coming up on the back here, back bumper's in good shape. A little bit of pitting on your chrome around your tail lights. A little bit of pitting around the chrome where your tail pipes come out. Check in in your trunk. Got a nice mat, you got a nice top cover here. And you got the old Mustang bag. Just kind of peek up under this, solid. Nice and clean. Package tray is nice and clean as well. Your jams look good on this one. The seal also in good shape. Go ahead and shut this trunk down. Shuts easy. Coming back this section here, lower portion. That just wiped off some dirt. slight bubble right there chrome looks good doors hanging a little bit at the bottom here a little spot in the corner there back your midsection light scuff spot here touch up mark in the back spot door handles in good shape a little bit of pitting window there watch there on the trim front windshields in good shape little spot up here in the nose let's check out the interior get her started 
you can see this interior is in great shape i'm loving the color i love the horses in the back door handle opens nice on this one the wind's getting it chips there and of course your door panels beautiful carpet interior seat it's pretty much perfect I don't see any tears Left a charger in here for trickle charging, storage. down pretty easy chip up here in the front guys I appreciate you watching if you're new to the channel hit subscribe share this video that helps me out quite a bit I'll keep pointing out the flaws for you so you know what you get before you get here detail pictures maplemotors.com financing shipping same site Every Monday I put on new rides. Thanks guys. See you later.